Hello everybody! I know it's been a while, but I am so glad to be back. Now today, I know it's posted a little bit later than I usually have them, I think up at like 8am, but we are doing a DMK video today. I just wanted to come on here real quick and say a few things. Now the, the schedule, like the upload schedule for the next couple of days is going to be a little bit different from what we're used to. Today a DMK update, tomorrow a DMK update, Sunday a DMK update, Monday a DMK update, Wednesday a DMK update, Thursday and Friday both DMK updates as well. So it's going to be a lot of DMK updates. Oh, sorry, I can't even speak. Just to uh, get try to get us caught back up. So it's going to be a couple weeks until we get caught up to where, you know, we should be. But that's okay. I'm so glad to be back. And um, Goosebumps is coming out every Tuesday as well. And Viewer's Choice, our last Viewer's Choice we're going to do on the channel will be coming up in the next couple of weeks. I haven't had time to do it yet, but it will be here soon and we'll have a big celebration to celebrate the end of that series for now and maybe if we can live stream in the future we can do it again. But let's jump on in to DMK. I want to meet Cinderella. Oh, okay. Um, I'll go to uh, try and find her for you, okay? Okay. I hear her, but... Oh, hi Cinderella. There's actually a guest that wants to meet you. Oh, splendid! Hello everyone and welcome back to yet another update of Disney Magia Kingdoms or Dylan Plays DMK, whatever you want to say. This is update number 123. I had to check there because it has been a while. Good to see you all again. Now let's jump right on in. Ashi Danza, who brother? Was that solo a thing of beauty? I am envious of your trumpet skills as always, my friend. Ha! Huh, you're not so bad yourself. You m melodious little mammal, you. Ha <laughs> ha, hey now. Leave me mammal... Leave my mammalness out of it, okay? I could play the Faldanza out of a ukulele as a frog, too, you know. Right, right. Well, next time you nail a horn solo with 80 teeth between you and the mouthpiece, you call me back, okay? <laughs> Quest complete. Got swing? Huh, I'm just playing around. You've got talent no matter what kind of animal you are, brother. Oh, how sweet. That was very sweet. Uh, it feels so good to be reacting to this again. And Grief Cargi here going from a level 1 to a level 2. Hello, Grief Cargo. I love his um, welcome screen. So high tech. Grief Cargo is now level two. Wonderful news! You have my sincerest thanks. Oh well, I'm glad to have that. Thank you. The business of Navarro is bounty hunting, and I have every confidence that business will be booming again soon. And when it is, I assure you, I'll have targets to spare. Lately, I've been receiving more pucks than I know what to do with. I've already started matching each one with a hunter, by way of preparation. There's a certain art to it, you know? I don't know, so thanks for telling me. <laughs> Take this puck, for example. Serial arsonists. Wanted in three systems, I ask myself, who do I know that's right for this job? Supply and demand, side quest, and grief cargo to consider bounty recipients. If I do mispronounce any words in this, I am so sorry. I really do apologize for it. I will try my best not to, but I'm not the best reader, so I'm sorry. Oh, and look at this here. This is for the main storyline for the Mandalorian event, which I know was a while ago, but we do have some catching up to do. So let's see here. Now, what about that extraction job you mentioned with Ranzar Malk's crew? There might, uh, there might be the sorry. Yes, maybe Kara could wind of caught wind of your involvement through some source or other, tracked you to their space station, and won't work. Oh, why not? No space station, not anymore. Uh-oh. Quest complete. How indeed. Ah, oh, you do have a certain talent for tying up loose ends, don't you? Oh no. What happened to the space station? Fine, forget the prison ship then. Surely there's some recent exploit of yours that could have piqued Kara's attention? You have to help me out here. After all, if I'd known where you were these past weeks, I'd have brought you in myself. Funny. Alright. I'd have sent a much better informed hunter to bring you in for me, but the point still stands. Hmm, guess it does. Give me a minute, I'll come up with something. Alright, so Tales of Mondo Pass, or Mando Pass, event quest. Build the Sandcrawler. Awesome, so we get another attraction in our kingdom. And here it is here, we already have the event, we have the event currency, so we are building it. And it only takes six minutes, how awesome is that? And now let's see who else is ready to be leveled up. And the Mandalorian himself, Mando. I don't know why I say Mondo. I know it's Mando. I'm so sorry. Um, he is leveling up. Well, there was the time I raided the Sandcrawler back on Arvala 7, but... 
That's perfect. Let's use that. Kara spoke to the Jawas on that crawler, say, and they slip a crucial piece of into... You can't be serious. That was before Kara and I even met. Well, if you attacked a Colossus like that single-handed, you'd have made a long-lasting impression. You know how Jawas talk. I really don't, actually. <laughs> Quest complete. Tales of Mando Pass. Just ask Kuil. Fair warning, though, he won't buy your story either. If it looks like I'm looking- oh, sorry. Have faith, Mando. Kara tracked you from that sandcrawler to your eventual capture. It's as believable as any other tale. Though, we'll likely have to m massage the details a bit. Why don't you recount the whole experience as thoroughly as possible? Okay, I tried a shot to the crawler's exhaust port first. No effect, so I got a handhold just above the- Ha! Huh, a bold ploy, but I'd expect no less of you, Snapchat. Now, if I could just expand on that theme a little... It happened like this event quest, send Mando into the Sandcrawler. I'm looking at my laptop over here, so I'm sorry if it looks like a little different. My setup's a little bit different, but Mando, the Mandalorian, is coming back into the kingdom now after leveling up, which is always amazing to have. Alright, so the Mandalorian is now level 3. I accept this with honor. Well, thank you so much. Thank you for the gem. I always love getting gems, so that's amazing. And now we are going to put him on the main storyline quest there. Um, I'm sorry, I can't pronounce that word. Perhaps? She's a marvel on a speeder bike. I imagine she'd jump at the chance to- oh, wait. Uh, are we glitching? Hold on, I'm sorry, I think my- my video is glitching a little. Ah, the... I'm not sure how to pronounce that either then. You can always depend on him to come through in the- oh, right, hmm. Quest complete. Supply and demand. Even for the most successful businesses, employee retention can be a challenge. I'm sorry, I don't know why that was glitching. I'm not sure if it was just my screen, but there you are in single combat atop a speeding crawler and boom, your opponent disarms and incapacitates you in one blow. Weeks later, Kara Dune would recover your shattered weapon from the scene, the very clue that would lead to your cap... No. <laughs> why, why not? I don't leave weapons behind, and you have me losing to one Jawa. One Jawa with an extremely large vibro lance, and excuse me for at least trying to make the tale dramatically satisfying. Quest complete. It happened like this? I don't plan to. <laughs> That's not how the, cr the crawler job went down at all, not even close. Hmm, well, I'd remind you that accuracy isn't exactly our aim here, but fine, tell it your way. I tried to, but... <sighs> fine. I'll try again. This time, let me talk. It happened like that, event quest. Send Mando into the sand crawler. Alright, so we're gonna have the... Oh, we're gonna hear the real story here from Mando himself, who was actually there. And let's see what else is going on. Looks like some more dialogue. By the time I came to, they were long gone. All I could do was double back and check the damage to the ship. Hmm. Not, um, belabor. I'm sorry, I don't know. But am I right in observing that you were defeated by a Jawa? Jawas, more than one, with ion blasters. They caught me off guard. Oh, well, that explains it then. I'm sure the client will be delighted to hear all about how you... Look, if we're saying Kara's the one who caught me, let's have her come up with the story. And where is Kara any- Oh dear, I'm afraid there's a significant gap in the data beginning at precisely that point. Quest complete. It happened like that. Perhaps it's for the best. I abhor heated altercations of that sort. <laughs> Alright, so maybe we'll- Oh, here we go. I hesitate to admit it, but reviewing that data card has piqued my curiosity somewhat. What precisely happens next? Allow me to search the data for additional mentions of Cara Dune. Perhaps that will lead to something more definitive. Welcome a Shock Trooper event quest. Welcome Cara Dune. Oh my gosh, I was very excited to welcome Cara Dune. So of course I was very, very, very excited to start collecting for her. But now Grief Karga is going into the level up machine to become a level 3. Which is always a great thing to have in your kingdom. Hello Grief Karga. Seems like Grief Karga and Mando were having a lot of um, difficulties in what they wanted to do. Grief Karga is now level 3. This is your success as much as mine, and I, for one, celebrate it. Well, I celebrate it as well. Thank you so much, Grief Karga. And it looks like some more Mandalorian characters are leveling up. So, yes, Kuil here is going from level 2 to level 3. Very, very exciting. Ooh! <laughs> 
Quill is so awesome. I hope I'm pronouncing his name right. I'm sorry if I'm not. Quill is now level 3. I am suited for such work. Thank you for the gem. I really do appreciate it. And some dialogue. One of the moisture vape vaporators on my farm stopped functioning yesterday. It, it, it is a problem with the primary condenser. I have repaired it to the best of my skill, but a replacement part is necessary. Today, I will trade for one. Oh, awesome. How much? I quest. Send Quill to trade at the Sandcrawler. I almost missed that, but it's okay. We got it. <laughs> and now the Mandalorian is leveling up here. I believe from a 3 to a 4. Let's see. I, it's going to tell us in a couple seconds, but let's enjoy this awesome welcome screen here. How cool. The Mandalorian is now level 4. This reward will sponsor many foundlings. Well, that sounds great to me. Thank you for the gem and some dialogue. The front landing strut on the Razor Crest has been sticking. Thought it was carbon scoring at first. Turns out there's still a part missing. Huh, <sighs> looks like someone didn't hold up their end of the deal. Uh-oh. Breach of contract side quest. Send Mando to the Sandcrawler for the spare part. Sounds great to me. So we are going to send him on that while we are waiting to welcome Cara Dune into our kingdom. And now we are leveling up Flash from a level 2 to a level 3, which is very exciting because Flash is awesome. I mean, what? He's just the best. <laughs> and there he is. Oh, he's so cute. Flash is now level 3. What an amazing thing to happen to me. <laughs> Alright, key witness. So we do have a side quest with Flash and Chief Bogo, so it looks like I am able to put them on that right now, which is amazing because my quest queue was filling up a bit here, as you can see. And that is actually the end of this update, update number 123. I hope you all enjoyed it. If you did, please hit that like button. Leave me any comments that you want me to read because I love to read them. And if you want to join the Disney Magic Kingdom family, please hit that subscribe button and tap that notification bell so you know every time I post a new video. I will see you all tomorrow for some more DMK content. See you then. Bye.